Hey, welcome back to The Corner, Chaplain's Corner. Thanks so much for being here, it means a lot. One of the biggest obstacles to financial health comes in the form of debt. With the average American owing more than $90,000. Now, while this figure does include home mortgages and other secured loans, credit card debt is over $5,000 for most people in this country. And if you've ever looked at the notices on a credit card statement that are now required by law that tell you how long you will be paying down that balance by only making minimum payments, it can feel really overwhelming and discouraging. So that brings us to the seventh budgeting tip. Use the debt snowball. It all starts by looking at your monetary action plan, your map, and calculating how much you can afford to spend each month to pay down your debt. Now, you want to be aggressive enough to get out of debt fast, but not so aggressive that you're miserable or ill-prepared for the unexpected. Then what you do is you list all of your debts in order from lowest balances to highest. Focus mostly on the ones with double-digit interest rates, 15, 20, or more percent. And don't worry about mortgages, auto loans, or student loans just yet. Posting these on the fridge or somewhere else that you'll see them, this list will often be even extra motivating to you. So then the next step is you decide to pay $5 more than the minimum payment on all of the debts, except for the one with the lowest balance. Paying even a little more than a minimum, even if it's just five or $10 is gonna help your credit score. So you got this list, you got the $5 more, and then you take whatever's left from your monthly amount that's going towards debt and you pay that whole amount, however much it is, on the account with the lowest balance. This is going to eliminate that debt faster for you. It's going to give you a victory to celebrate as you cross it off the list. And then it's going to free up those funds to snowball and go to the account with the second lowest balance. And you repeat this process month after month after month until the snowball builds enough to retire all of those high interest debts. As always, if you need help with this, I know it's a little confusing just hearing it from, uh, from my mouth, but if you need help with what it looks like for you specifically, or really with anything else that may be going on in your life, call me absolutely any time. Be well.